Although this is a Nintendo 64 Rare Rare game, this game is rated M for Mature. This game is not for anyone under the age of 17. The commentary may not reflect this rating. Viewer discretion is advised. This zombie responded, so I'm gonna take care of that one. Now we have the next wave of zombies, and that's just not gonna be fun. And if you die, then you have to do this thing all over again. And there's just time for the camera... I almost didn't get him. Make sure to put your A-game ready. These guns are more effective if they're up close range. There could be some coming out of that corner. Come to me. Clear. I'm out of here, buddy. How are you doing? It's always good to, like, land on that table. I'm gonna go for that table. They can't get me on the table. They can't get me on the table. Yeah, these zombies can't get me on the table. Yeah, one guy just went flat dead. Damn you. Headshot. Okay. All right. Also, make sure you use the C stick to uh, dr to uh, drift your directions. So that could be really helpful. Now we're gonna be crossing this bridge, which could lead to more zombies. Yo, come to me. Come to me to die.
So let's use the C-stick to move. Does this feel like a real Walking Dead movie? Maybe. Die. But there's definitely more inside this courtyard. Keep the change, you filthy animal. Oh, hello. Almost didn't see you. But you were having the most fun of your life. Is that zombie slightly coming towards me? I have no idea. Okay, I'm gonna put my gun away for right now. Get wrecked. Take the key and just run. I think if I uh, jump, I can get rid of the key in an instant. Plot twist I have to outrun some zombies that just responded. Because I think zombies could respawn. So far, everything seems to be peaceful. I took care of the majority of the zombies coming up to this point. Just some zombies will just respawn, and some zombies would just do their own thing. Maybe there will be a time where you have to outrun one. There's for one zombie that I knew I killed twice already. And now another section is added. It's upstairs. So I have to go upstairs a little bit. I don't know if beyond that point it would save. I find the ladder. The ladder's right there. Okay, you just need to get to that ladder. But I'm expecting an out of nowhere zombie. Alright, here's the ladder. Climb up. Get some free chocolates. Get our health back from these darn zombies. Ooh! I almost fell because of the uh, control. 
Oh my. Uh, okay. Yeah, I wish there was like a drop shadow so I could figure out the best timing to make the jump. But then uh, you don't you have absolutely no idea where to go. Maybe I should probably analyze the room before I even try it, because like conquer climb up the ladder. Please. Thank you. Alright, I'm just gonna analyze the room before I even do this. I think they want me to go that way. That's why I want them to think, but the game could just tell me otherwise. There we go. Grab this bone. Open up the secret passages. I feel like that's why I need to go. I'm a little bit confused, but... Okay, I'm gonna drop this. Okay, sure. Okay, now I'll circle around back. And I guess we'll just take that lower entrance. Imagine they want me to actually take the upper route. Or just find a way to get up there. Like, God knows I'll be able to find a way up there. Yes, no, maybe not. So, you know, here we are with the key. We're gonna have to take that key all the way back. That's the last key we need. Finally leaving this place. Oh, the enemies probably responded. Yeah, they did. The enemies responded. Gotta run, gotta run, gotta run. Don't have time for you. Don't have time for you. Finally, I'm out of here. Finally. Oh yeah, I forgot about those guys. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. That barrel. <sighs> Bye. So now, the fun part. We blow this joint out of here. And, uh, okay. Let me work the camera a little bit. This is very dangerous. Very dangerous. But you gotta re-grab the barrel every time you respawn, so... But luckily, it isn't the end of a world. You have to re-grab the barrel every time you respawn, though, so... If I could take it slow, I could! But for being something really fast, you don't wanna, like take too much time. I'm probably gonna get another game over trying to do another complicated gameplay style. Cause as y'all know, Conquer is all filled with complicated gameplay styles. Like this is rare where when they've been in a bar trying to think to themselves, like say, how are we gonna make our company successful? Because like we're about to be sold to Microsoft soon, and if we don't think of good sales, then we're pretty much a dead company. And uh, I got pretty far, but that wasn't enough. Oh, 
I wonder how many game overs I got. I feel like it's, I feel like I definitely got around ten game overs at that point. Luckily for checkpoints, though, so we don't have to worry too much. Whoa. Wonder who was inside that barrel? Cause that barrel had eyes inside of it. I feel like there's someone inside of it. I'm trying to center the camera. Whoa. Whoa. Also, just trying to take my time. And again, these things control like a car. And very insane! Oh my lord, I made it! Okay. I made it. Nice. Now for the next bit, which shouldn't be difficult at all. Unless I die here and was like, okay, and I really hate to do that twice. But I'm gonna try to outrun this. I'm gonna outrun this. There's no way they're gonna catch me now. Thankfully, I don't need the barrel for that. Hi, fish. I'm not sure that's the same fish that died from a dog, but then again, if you think about it, fish have cat cats have nine lives. Yeah, the only way to get up here is to use the barrel. That's basically the only way to get up here. Get some free money. No, you want some great stuff. <gasps> yeah, cash price. All right, so you may be wondering where were we now, actually? Well, if you guys remember, during the very first episode of this game, we took and got the devil here. And uh, if the devil is here, then we should all know where we are at this point. So, therefore, hello birdie, long time no see, glad you're still sleeping. So, I'm gonna end the episode pretty much right where I began my journey. Right here is where I'm gonna end this episode. So, as you all know, thank you guys so much for watching this Let's Play of Conqueror's Bad Fur Day. I hope you guys enjoy this Let's Play, and if you do so, make sure to slap a like on this video if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you legends in the next one. Good night, guys.